Hey cuties, Peachy here. Welcome back to a new video. And you guys, we have so we, so much Rainbow High news has come out today. So many, so many stock photos. So many official um, announcements. Uh, I actually have to make four videos for each individual, so I can really go into in depth into each individual uh, subject. So first up in this four parter, I guess, is uh, the Dia de los Muertos. Uh, collector celebration doll I don't know what the title is exactly but it's Maria Garcia and uh, this is the she's gonna be the one that cost 130 yes a lot of money so let's get into it so about four hours ago she got revealed officially on the official Rainbow High Instagram account uh, this is the picture it looks stunning I cannot wow I mean they have a little bit of a caption there that she designed her own dress, just like Lily Chang, and that she'll come out very soon. And it's like, wow. Um, so this is actually not the only picture we have of her. We also have the actual listing of her on Walmart. Yes, she's already listed, but I think it's only on pre-order for right now. So um, we'll switch over to uh, the Walmart websites and uh, talk about the stock photos. Cause there are, of course, we can see all that she comes with. Uh, but this photo is very beautiful. Like I do love how it's like just just like just how it's all uh, captured. It's it, it's it's stunning. Honestly, she looks so good here. Um, but uh, of course, that's not that like a real life photo. That's very heavily edited and filtered. So let's take a closer look at the stock photos next. So here we are on Walmart.com, and here she is, Rainbow High 2022. Uh, celebration edition Dia de los Muertos Maria Garcia fashion collector doll with celebratory face painting and calavera purse light up display and accessories great gift and collectors um so apparently you can actually already buy her because it here's the um add to cart at the bottom so if you live in the U.S., you can already get her, which is amazing. Uh, I don't, so I cannot. <laughs> but um, here is Maria Garcia. Um, uh, that she wow, the stock photo here, the first one. She has the um, it's so so shallow here, like the little. It's so weird having it uh, a square. Here, the website it really leaves no space to actually see the doll. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll try to put in the picture here. Um, I just wanted to show that this is on walmart.com, you know, stock photos like publicly obtained. It's not like, mis like I just, in case MJ is watching, you know, um, cause I'm still on thin ice and I just hope it's okay. I'm uh, showing the stock photos. <laughs> so here's the first picture. Uh, again, I'll show a better picture over this. And then she's just really stunning, has her hat on. The hat is really big actually, and um, I can't believe you can actually like put it on. But of course uh, you can, but you gotta take off the um, the headdress first. So that's the first picture. The second picture is actually really nice because uh, you can see her in the box and you can actually tell uh, where the light is gonna come out from. It's from the sides, which is amazing. It looks stunning. I love it. It looks really nice. It's like blue, purple. Um, and then here on the left door, it has like Dia de los Muertos, really nice design pattern in the background. And then on the right, hang on, it says in honor of her Mexican heritage and the traditions of Dia de los Muertos, Maria Garcia designed her very own custom gown and calavera skull handbag. It's her favorite day of the year because it celebrates her two passions, familia and fashion. Okay, I like her, she's cute. Okay, so that's a little bit of the te text on the right. Then here's another picture of her with her headdress on and on her doll stand. Um, again, super pretty. I feel like the more I look at her, the more I'm okay with her. Like, I feel like she's really pretty, but um, at the same time, I'm like, mm, they took MJ really, MJ's really always like, Bruf. like they should have just gone with a more traditional style dress. Cause this is, uh, this is obviously not like um, traditional, like celebratory Dia de los Muertos dress. It's, this is more like a flamenco dress inspired. So I don't know. Just wish they would have been more uh, appropriate, I guess. Uh, here is a close-up of her headdress. Her face-up's really beautiful. The skull, um, the painting 
uh, it's really it's really big, really bold. Uh, I hope it just looks as good for every every doll's uh, face paint. Um, the earrings huge. Also, you can tell she has like the like the uh, ske skeleton um, hand over in gold over her hands. Really nice. Um, and then here is everything she comes with. Her hat, the bodysuit skeleton mesh piece, her boots and fabric, her two skeleton gold hands, the earrings, the actual and actually the the roses are separate from the headdress. The, interesting. Her purse, brush, uh, the comb, and her doll stand, and then of course her dress. So that's all she comes with, and she does retail at 130. So amazing. I don't know where that money went into. <laughs> Uh, and then the, I feel like the most stunning picture here is this one. It's of the box uh, And you can see there's like a little ribbon and also this little flower I'm not sure if they all include the flower of or if the flower is like printed on But it does look like an actual like plastic flower at the very least. I feel like that's a very nice touch um, That's some um, that's a marigold, right? Yeah, so I feel like that would be real awesome if they actually all included a flower like that um, And the ribbon's a really nice touch too so yeah, the box is really nice. Obviously very much like Lily Chang's boss box. And that's it, basic. Yeah, that's all there is to Maria Garcia. Um, again, if you live in the US, you can probably already get, get, get her, purchase her from Walmart. The link is also in the official Rainbow High Instagram story, I think, or it says in bio. So they, they in the caption on Instagram, they said, link in bio so you know it's there if you want to buy her um also um otherwise i will try to leave the link uh here on the down below to to get her i'm here in person i just thought you know as long as i already have makeup on i can use my face uh while i i can show my face i can show my face while i actually talk about how i feel about this doll so maria garcia is her name um really nice name i mean i thought they would have gone with something a little bit more you know unique i don't know i no offense but it's just like it's like come on really like maria like they couldn't have gone with a more like inspired name i don't know it's not it's not a big deal i'm just saying like it's just a little bit like mm, really mj really um <laughs> And then the dress. The dress is more flamenco inspired. It's really red. There's more like roses, accents, and her hair is purple for some reason. Why couldn't it have been like brown or black? Like why? Um, and then, yeah, I don't, and then she's so expensive. Like what, what, what is happening? What is happening? MJ is giving us no longer second outfits, but instead they're giving us a doll, one doll here with one outfit, an extra hat, a purse, a doll stand, a comb, and a light-up feature that's built in somewhere. And you're supposed to pay 130 bucks for that. Like, and then they're also selling fashion packs now, 10 bucks each for an outfit, shoe, and handbag. I don't know what's going on here, um, but maybe those are just overall thoughts, I guess, for like Rainbow High and what's happening. But uh, Maria, she's cute. Like, I would get her, obviously. I will get her because I'm a completionist. I want to get all the original characters. Um, but I'm definitely going to wait until she goes on sale or something. Because she's, uh, I like her design, but she's not like, oh my god, I need her. You know what I mean? Like, um, I'm not going to die if I don't have her immediately. So I'm, I'm going to wait until she's cheaper. I feel like that's what most people are going to do. Unless, again, you have the kind of money which more power to you, you know, um, but uh, most of us will probably just wait, so me too, I'm gonna wait. <laughs> She's cute, but like, you know, thinking overall, like, if I had that money, would it, would I even feel good spending it, knowing that that's all I get, you know, I don't know, just, it's, it's kind of like, you know, it just feels a little bit like a, like a ripoff, you know, and I'm, and I'm just being honest here, that's just how it feels like to me, um, Especially because the design is also not like perfect. If, if the design, if the design were like top tier, you know, I feel like you would feel less bad to spend money, you know. But because she's not even really all that to begin with, it's like kind of hard to justify, you know. I don't know. <laughs> and that's just my thoughts. Anyways, um, 
so yeah overall i think she's really pretty uh again why purple hair i wish they would have given her like brown black hair uh maybe a more unique name but it's more like i'm just being nitpicky there um and her dress i feel like i really wish it would have been a little more original a little more colorful um because it's just red and like flamenco basically it's like kind of mm, you know, it's just, it's just uh, really not creative, you know, it's like very uninspired. Uh, I feel like that was, that was just like the very obvious way to go and they just took it, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, overall I think she's still really pretty. Uh, I just really hope that the face paint looks that good when you get her, you know? Like it's not defect, there's no, there's no defects or anything. Um, but yeah. That's that's my that's my thoughts. I don't know what else to say. <laughs> but yeah, that was the video. I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give me a big thumbs up. Also, let me know what you thought down below. Your thoughts on Maria. Will you get her? Will you wait to get her? Uh, and as always, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you haven't already, so you don't miss. I want to post more Rainbow High doll news. A bunch of Rainbow High dolls news is coming uh, tonight. It's a bunch of stuff I got to talk about. Um, doll reviews, episode reaction videos, a bunch more content coming your way daily and keeping you up to date with what adulty you love stay safe be kind i hope this next time stay peachy kisses